This sort of job is not, is not an easy one. I think everyone knows that. And I think what makes it easier is the people around you. Yeah, they've been fantastic, the team that I work in. Real social work is about working with real people. You can't be this sort of corporate body when you're working with a family. You have to be able to communicate really well with people. You have to be able to just talk sense and, and straight talk. We as a local authority have really grasped change and aren't afraid to run with that. I feel that we are protected. Well, in West Sussex Children's Social Care, um, I think what makes us different is we have ambition and we have ambition for delivering excellent standards um, and outcomes for our children. And we strive after that relentlessly. And our best tool to make that happen is our staff. They're a really good bunch and I like working with them. And I think that my manager's brilliant and she's really supportive. And I think that makes a huge difference to how you feel about going to work. We're able to talk openly about our cases to each other. Um, I know if I'm having a difficult um, day at work that there'll be someone there that I can talk to, whether that's in a formal supervision with my manager or just a one-to-one -one chat with a colleague. There's a kind of mutual understanding of how difficult and taxing the job is. Um, and also this kind of interest between myself and my colleagues in their cases and what's happening, who they're working with and how that's um, helping them to support and assist the families that they work with. The best thing in social work since I've been in West Sussex has been implementing signs of safety within the team and getting a very clear model of working with teenagers, older teenagers, and risk assessment for care leavers. The signs of safety model means that we're able to use much more straightforward language to explain what's not working and what needs to change. You are actually getting in there and, and working with parents in a, in a real way. You know, you're not going in just telling them what they're doing wrong and what they have to change, because that doesn't work and we know that doesn't work. And people have to be invested in change. Before, you quite often would just work with the parent and try and affect change with them. That would then have an impact on the children, whereas actually now we start with the child and then you work your way round with all the other people that are involved with that child and how everybody else works together to make a change for them. So it's rather than just saying to the parents, well, you need to do this, this, this and this to make that change, you're actually working with them as a group, deciding together what needs to change for the better for their child. It's really embedded well and it's in every part of our practice. Everyone's embracing that rather than it just being this is a social work tool. So everybody's working to the same model, so we're all using the same language. Children's Services is going through um, a redesign and within that I think we feel supported and we feel clear about um, how things are going to look. So there's lots of change happening but that change doesn't feel particularly scary I think because of the environment that West Sussex has created really and I think that a lot of that comes from how inclusive um, the staff briefings have been. We've had staff briefings where the senior managers, the head of service, have come to us and said, look, we want to hear from you. How can we make this restructure um, work? How can we make it more effective? I would say it's very exciting. Um, there's a lot of um, energy um, and also challenging, but in a good way. But there's loads of opportunities for training. There's loads of opportunities for being involved and sharing good practice, about going to different focus groups, um, different sort of management forums where you're sharing your work. The facilities are great actually. You know, we've just been upgraded, um, Blackberry work mobiles, you know, we have our own laptop. It's great um, offices and things like that to use. I am proud to work for this local authority because I like working here. I enjoy working here. Um, I also feel proud of the way that we as a local authority have really grasped change and aren't afraid to run with that and the signs of safety is a good example. The team that I work with are an excellent team and I think they've done some really innovative and creative work around signs of safety and they, I think they really go the extra mile for the young people that, uh, that they work with. I'm most proud of the fact that they are willing to invest in us. So I will constantly say to staff you will make mistakes. This is a high risk business. And if you've done your best with the information you've got and it's a conscientious error, I won't be behind you, I won't be beside you, but I'll be in front of you. And that's the contract we make together. If you're not feeling emotionally supported, um, if you're not feeling protected as well, I think that's one of the main things is that I feel that we are protected.